welcome to or welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, my name is Anne and this is All the Budgeting. I am on a journey to repair and recover from filing for Chapter 13 bankruptcy in November of 2021. And I am using a cash envelope budgeting system to help me do that. And so what happens on this channel is I do paycheck stuffings, I do side hustle stuffings, I do cash condensing whenever necessary, and I always close out my budget every month, which would include a net worth calculation. So if that is something that uh, interests you, I do hope that you consider subscribing, liking, commenting, all of that. Do really appreciate everybody that has subscribed so far. I am more than halfway. Uh, to the point of monetization. So I'm really hopeful that I will be monetized before the end of 2022 and add to my side hustle income. So uh, really appreciate everybody who has subscribed so far. Okay, so for today's video, we are going to be doing my second paycheck for the month of August, um, that cash stuffing. I do get paid twice a year. Uh, twice a year, twice a month. Good Lord. <laughs> that would be difficult to, uh, to budget if I only got uh, paid twice a year. No, I get paid twice a month. So we're doing my second paycheck stuffing for the month of August. So let's go ahead and pull up my planner and, um, this planner is available in my Etsy shop. I do have that link below. This is a digital hyperlinked planner. So you're able to, you know, navigate to the various uh, items and all of that very easily with um, a note taking app such as GoodNotes. Uh, this is also available as a printable version if you prefer that. And I also do have it as um, already printed bound paperback books in um, Amazon. So all of that is linked below, as well as the envelopes that I am using. I also do um, sell those as printables in my Etsy shop, and I am using new envelopes today. So, um, okay, so let's go ahead to my stuffing here. Okay, so for this paycheck, I had some extra money coming in here. So my actual paycheck was 3,928. I did have about 115 in rollover. This is one of my extra week months or extra week paychecks um, because I get paid twice a month, not every other week. Sometimes there's an extra week um, because I always start my you know, spending and all of that on Fridays. Um, so sometimes there's extra weeks in there. So I, that's one of my envelopes. I save for that. And so I'm bringing in that money. And then I did do a cash, uh, cash out of $25 from an app called Dosh. If you're not familiar with it, it is um, an app that gives you cash back when you use a linked card at um, various local establishments. It's mostly restaurants. Um, and more local restaurants than like big chains, although sometimes Dunkin' is on there. Um, but there are some stores in there, Sam's Club, Costco's on there, um, Mattress Firm, you know, things like that. So um, I'm gonna look, I think I can get a referral code and I will have that linked uh, below. So, you know, I really like those cashback apps because if you're gonna spend the money anyway, might as well get some money back for it, right? So um, it's kind of, free money in my in my opinion. And I'm not sure with Dosh if you can exchange for gift cards. You know, some of them you can exchange for gift cards or get the cash or some you can just do gift cards. Um, but I, it was very easy just to link my PayPal account to it and I just got $25 and that's gonna go into my home improvement um, envelope. You know, that's what that is for. So. So my total income that I am working with uh, for this video is $4,368. My total fixed bills and expenses comes to $2,923. That's money that stays in my checking account and the bills just get paid automatically. So I don't pull that out and stuff it. Okay, so what we are left with, what we will be stuffing today is 
So let's get to our second page here. Move this over and let's give this money a count first. Okay, so we have one, two, three, four, five, six hundred. 657, 758, 850, <clears throat> 870, 90, 910, 30, 50, 70, 90, 1010, 30, 50, 70, 90, 1110, 30, 50, 70, 90, 210, 30, 50, so 1,250, 60, 70, 80, 90, 1,300, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 95, 1,400, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 41, 2, 3, 4, and 5. So 1,445. As always, we're going to start with our priority one binder. And so emergency fund is getting its normal $50 today. So we'll add that. So an emergency, we have 1,000 in the bank. 51, 52, 53, 50, 70, 90, 410, 30, 50. So 1,450. 30 today. So in extra debt, we have 51, 20, 40, 55. So 155. And I'll let this build until I reach 500 and then I will uh, deposit it to pay into whatever uh, debt I am working on. Currently, I am working on my AC unit. Um, whoops. Okay, health is getting 145, so it's getting a little bit more than its normal 70, um, and that is because. Uh, this is, I'm bulking this up a bit, and this is actually the last uh, week that I'm uh, bulking it up, um, and I'm also starting on my next category to bulk up. Okay, so currently in health, I have one, two, three, four, four, fifty, five, twenty, forty, fifty, five, sixty. So five hundred and sixty dollars. That feels good to have that in this account because um, I've mentioned before, I do have some health issues. So, um, you know, I kind of have to do doctor's appointments and tests and all that kind of stuff. Um, so it is nice to kind of have some money in there uh, as a buffer. I will still continue to put you know, regular money in that because, um, you know, I do have prescriptions that are quite expensive. And so I want to make sure that I'm preparing for those, but it'll just get the normal amount going forward. So, okay. Home maintenance. I have, I'm um, getting 15 and this envelope is actually empty right now. So that is all it has currently. Um, I needed some things done to my place and my brother is uh, very handy and he handles pretty much all of that for me, um, which I'm very grateful for because he has literally saved me thousands of dollars. Um, yeah, so, and I get to hang out with my brother, so. Okay, so home improvement is getting that $25 from Dosh. 
and we're gonna add to this. And I'm real excited because um, I can get my uh, TV stand that I've been saving up for because I just had a birthday and um, I got some gift cards from Amazon. So between those and this um, and some other uh, cash back apps that I am, you know, getting Amazon gift cards for, I have enough to get this uh, TV stand that matches my, uh, what is it called, coffee table and end table. And then that kind of completes my living room, which I redid um, at the end of last year. So I'm excited about that. So this money is gonna, um, I'm gonna be doing a cash condensing at the end of the month. So this money is actually gonna come out and I'm gonna purchase that. And then we'll start saving for the next home improvement project. So currently in home improvement, I have 100 in the bank, 20, 25, 30, 35. So 135, the um, stand is like $460. It's, you know, pretty substantial. Um, and so, like I said, I've got gift cards from my birthday and all that kind of stuff. So combined with that, I have enough. Car maintenance is getting 15. Oops. Okay, so currently in car maintenance, I have 100, 200 in the bank, 250, 70, 90, 310, 30, 40, 50, 55, 60, 65. So 265, no, 365, right? 365. And that's an, another one that I really like to just kind of keep contributing to, to bulk up because, you know, when that stuff happens, it's expensive. And so I'd rather have the money, uh, you know, put aside to, to pay for it. Okay. Pet care. So pet care is the next one that I am bulking up. Um, and so it is getting 155 today. And the cat I have now is he's pretty healthy. Um, he doesn't have any health issues. I had a cat pre uh, previously who had a lot of health issues. Um, I loved him dearly and I did everything I could, um, you know, while he was with me to keep him healthy and comfortable and all of that. I don't regret it whatever, whatsoever. But, you know, I know how expensive it can be. I do have pet insurance, um, but you do have to pay up front for uh with pet insurance you have to pay and then you get reimbursed so so i really want to bulk this up just in case anything does uh ever happen with him right and even just for normal um vet visits and food and all that kind of stuff so so this is the next category i am bulking up so currently in pet care i have 150 60 65 70 75 so 175 And when I say I'm bulking up just for anybody that might be new, um, I did get um, a very, I got a promotion um, in March. And with that promotion, I got a, a raise that I really wasn't expecting because I had just gotten a really nice raise at the end of the year with the normal performance process. And so because of that, I wasn't, I knew that this promotion was kind of, lingering out there and I thought for some reason that maybe I got the raise before the promotion and so I really wasn't expecting a raise along with the promotion but I got one and it was a very nice one and so since it was you know money that I wasn't expecting and with just the raise I got at the end of the year I was, you know, very comfortable and able to pay all my bills and save and all that kind of stuff. What I'm doing is that extra money that I got, um, I am first bulking up some of my priority um, funds. And then once those are uh, bulked up, which I'm on schedule uh, to have those completely where I want them, um, 
by like early next year, then the, then the plan is to put all that extra money to debt um, to pay off my, um, I have a my AC unit and then my car and then my bankruptcy because my goal is to pay my bankruptcy in uh, three years or less. I do have five years to pay it. That's the, you know, the way it's structured, but I want to pay it in three years or less. So that's my goal. Okay. So sorry, I'm being chatty this morning. Um, so electronics is 15. Okay, so for electronics, I have 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 30, 40, 45, 50, 55. So 155 in electronics. Extra week is getting 15. I do have I think there's one more extra week in this year and so I do have that funded so now I'm building for next year and there's four of them so with my extra weeks I want $300 and that just covers groceries spending and gas because all of my bills are paid out of my two paychecks so I just kind of need to cover those those three items for that extra week so <clears throat> so for extra week Currently, we have one, two, three hundred in the bank. That's for the last one for this year. And then building for next year, 20, 40, 50, 60, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90. So 390. Okay, subscriptions. is getting 30. Oops, I need to switch my binder, hold on. Yeah, I will be definitely be doing a cash condensing because uh, my envelopes are getting a bit chunky. Okay, so now my priority two binder and this one has some of my kind of uh, revolving spending as well as some uh, sinking funds. So rollover, we don't uh, have anything in there. Rollover is any money that I have left over from my grocery budget, from my spending, um, as well as anything that uh, in my fixed bills came in less than I had expected. I put that money into rollover, add it to the next paycheck. Okay, so groceries, because of the three weeks, um, I am putting aside 450. That's where that extra week comes in. So three 100 bills and three 50s. So one, two, three, 350, four, 450, because I budget $150 a week for groceries. So that'll cover me for those three weeks. And then spending, similar. Um, I budget $100 a week for spending. So normally it's $200, but with that extra week, it's 300 and I do that all in 20s. So 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, 60, 82, 20, 40, 60, 83. Okay, hair is just getting a hundred. I budget a hundred dollars a paycheck because I um, I go every three weeks for um, for hair. Sorry, I didn't count that, but it has two hundred in it. Okay, so now moving back over to my sinking funds. Subscriptions is getting 30 today. And I'm pretty sure I have another subscription funded 
fully for next year. So with my cash condensing, I'll be pulling that out and putting placeholders in. So currently for subscriptions, I have 150, 200, 20, 40, 60, 80, 300, 20, 40, 60, 80, 400, 10, 20, 30, 35, 40, 45. So 445. And this is all of my, you know, subscriptions that are paid for this year and I'm building for next year now. Um, I have to look though, because I think I might have forgotten to account for one subscription. Um, so this goal might be a little bit higher uh, than 1180. Um, I have to look to see, did I account for it? Um, okay, so vacation is getting 15. So currently in vacation, 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90, 95, 100, 5, 105. Christmas is getting 10. So in Christmas, I have 100, 20, 40, 50, 60, 70, 75, 80. So 180. Holiday dinner is getting 10. I am hosting Thanksgiving. The goal is $500. Um, and I mean, I'm, I'm not as close as I should be to that. I do typically get a bonus uh, that I would be able to use for that as well. So I'm kind of counting on that. <laughs> so fingers crossed, I've never not gotten it. So I don't really see not getting it. Um, okay, so holiday dinner, I get 100, 10, 20, 30, 35, 40. The goal is 500 for that. I don't have a huge family. So it's not, uh, you know, too bad. Gifts, I have all my gifts funded for this year, so now I'm focusing on next year. Um, I just have five nieces and nephews that I buy birthday gifts for, and then I have my mom's birthday, Mother's Day, and then like I just usually have a little bit of a buffer in there for anything else that might pop up. So uh, in gifts, I have 10, 20, 30, 35, 40, 45. Okay, yeah, that's also a chunky one. I could use a condensing. Okay, and then lastly, we have my priority three binder. Entertainment is getting $10. And in entertainment, I have 10, 20, 30, 40, 45, 50, 55. Close is getting 10 and is currently empty. I bought some uh, new workout clothes. I just joined Planet Fitness and so I needed to get some, you know, just uh, some workout clothes. So. so I did that and bonus, I got it from Kohl's and I got $20 in Kohl's cash um, that I had to use this week. I was at Kohl's with my mom yesterday and so I was like, oh, I, I need to spend that because, you know, you only get it for a week, um, which I don't love. But um, and so I found a really cute top that was on sale for twenty one ninety nine, And so, um, you know, I, I said, OK, I want to use my Kohl's cash for that. And then so I was only going to have to pay like two something with tax. And um, she said, uh, you have another $5 in here that expires in September. Do you want to use it? And I'm like, yeah. So I got a free top. <laughs> so love that. Always participate in any of those reward programs that um, places offer because it's free money. Um, and it just, it rewards you for shopping there. 
Um, okay, so Beauty is getting $10. Okay, so in Beauty, I have 20, 30, 40, 50, 55, 60, 65. Miscellaneous is getting 10, and that is also empty because with the workout clothes, I kind of had to pull from there as well. And that's what it's for, miscellaneous. So miscellaneous has 10. Okay, new car is getting five. It's currently a new car. I have 100 in the bank, 10, 20, 30, 35, 40, 45. And this is, you know, just slowly building um, so that when I do buy a new car, I have a down payment. New house, also getting five, same thing. I don't really have any plans to move, but you know, why not just put aside money now, let it build, and then if I decide not to move at some point, um, I don't think that'll be the case. I do think that I do wanna move eventually, um, where I don't know, but anyway. Uh, so again, just kind of letting this build and uh, you know, save up. So, okay, new house, 100. 10, 20, 30, 35, 40, 45. And then planner stuff is getting that last $5. And so currently in planner stuff, I get, I have 100, 10, 20, 25, 36, 7, Eight nine thirty, so one thirty. Okay, so that does it for today's uh, paycheck cash stuffing. Next up will be I will close out my budget for August. I can't believe that August is almost over already. Where did the summer go? <laughs> Um, but that's okay, because we're heading into my favorite season, which is fall. Um, I love fall, like a lot of people. Um, so we're we'll be closing out the August budget, um, do my net worth calculation and all of that. Uh, so that'll be next week. And then again, with this extra week in there, uh, there, you know, I would normally, the next one after that would be a paycheck stuffing, but it doesn't line up uh, time-wise. So then the next one after that will be my condensing. So um, yeah, so that's about it for today. I hope you all have a great week. Thanks, bye.